of this great country. The speaker's remarks made on Wednesday came shortly after she received a petition from a section of medical interns led by the former president of the Uganda Medical Association, Dr. Ekwaru Obuku. The interns, much as they promised they are going to work, the interns need to be paid. Prime Minister, you made a commitment during the budget day. Kindly make a follow-up and ensure that the 1,900 interns are deployed and are paid. We'll be very grateful to receive a report from you on the payment of interns and the deployment of those interns. And as we sit here now, after the 1,900 are paid, there is an accumulation of 4,000 interns yet to be deployed and to be paid. And this would help us as legislature to plan better on how much money should always be given to health so that they can be able to save lives. Prior to this, the speaker assured leadership of the intern doctors in the country that the parliament will use its powers to ensure that the concerns and pains of the medical fraternity are ably settled. Among the issues they want to be addressed include the deployment of medical interns. They also want the Ministry of Health to cancel what the junior doctors termed as discriminative deployment of interns. It should be noted that earlier this month, the Ministry of Health asked medical interns who can cater for their internship to register and start straight away as the rest wait for funds from the Ministry of Finance. Anselm Ojaru, Anit Nakasozi, live at 8.